Uh, hello, my name is Ilias van Klepet. I'm from Belgium. I'm a former ITL student and I'm now an ITL alumni. Um, I'm a Belgian, as you can tell, and I studied ITL because of the overall interest in tourism. My, um, inter uh, my future is like seen abroad, so that's why ITL as well. And I'm just like interested in like other cultures, which makes ITL the perfect thing to study because you get to know the world and you can have an excuse to just travel around the world without people thinking that you're an absolute lunatic. Um, the future is um, yeah, looking bleak right now because I'm still in lockdown in Spain. But well, shit happens, could be worse. Um, the future, like work related, is going to be more like um, real estate, uh, but then abroad, like here in Spain, Torrevieja, Alicante region, maybe Barcelona would be preferred. Uh, my best memories, oh damn, um, I've had so many good memories during ITL. My first um, exchange to Alicante University was awesome, like six months of great fun. Um, my internship to Tenerife last year was, let's say, spectacular. And the, just the greatest thing I think I received from ITL, the best memory, is just the amount of friends I made along the way during my internship. Uh, I made friends across the world, from the Netherlands, Tenerife itself, from mainland Spain, to other Belgians just being there, from tourists to other trainees. It's kind of what the, um, what made the thing that like made the internship what it was. And the best memory was for sure Siam Park. It's the biggest water park from Europe, and it's located in Tenerife. So yeah, and it was like with the whole group of trainees. So that was quite fun. And my main quote. Um, that I would describe myself it is sick parvis magna, which is Latin for uh, greatness from small beginnings, which is kind of what I did. I mean, people don't believe in you, but afterwards, I'm still here in Spain. People think, oh, you're going to study something that small, but I mean, it could be worse, right? People are in a lockdown in Belgium with grey weather, but look at this.